Kick just came out with the ability to make clips directly on their site. So let me show you how to make them. First thing you want to do is make sure that you are logged in. So you can see I'm logged in in the top right. I didn't know who to make a clip of in this video. So I just went through my latest followers on here and I went for the person that was live. So shout outs to Flavio. I asked him in the chat if it'd be okay if I could use a part of his stream for this video. He said it was cool. So make sure to drop Flavio a follow on Kick to help him out. So in order to use the clip feature, I'm going to wait for him to get a kill, which he just got. So I'm going to wait about 15 seconds until after he gets this kill. Nice kill, Flavio. Because the minimum amount of clip time right now is 15 seconds, so I don't want to hit the button too early. This man is absolutely killing it right now. So when you're ready to make the clip, I'm going to go into the bottom right of this little stream preview, and there's a button that says create clip. So I'm going to hit that. And now you can see we can go and scrub in this video. I'm going to pause the main video so it's not too confusing. But you can see in the top right corner, you have to have a clip description. Otherwise, it will not post. So I'm going to make one real quick. And then now that we've made a title, you can see it says publish, but we want to make some more adjustments. So I want to find exactly where he got that kill. I'm going to make it about 15 seconds long because you can adjust with left and right here. And I'm just going to scrub until right about where he gets the kill. I know we got it right at the end of the bridge there. So I'm just going to try and find oh right there. So I'm going to maybe drag it here. You can also mess with the preview on the video player itself right here. I'm going to go a little bit earlier just to get some context. So there we go. He sees him shooting at him. He's going back. Wop. Got him. All right. Sick. So that's the clip I want to do. I got the right selection right here. When I'm ready to do it, I have it titled. I'm going to hit publish. Give it a couple seconds. It's going to publish it. Now it's going to give you a URL that you can share on Facebook, Twitter, or in the chat. But I'm just going to copy it and open it in a new tab. So I've opened it in a new tab. It says we got to start watching it right here. And it's going to share the clip with us that I just made. Show how many views it has in the top. And right now you can actually click the download button, which I wasn't actually expecting because they said they're going to come out with it later. But it was literally less than 24 hours later. So shout outs to Kick Team for working so gosh darn fast. And you can also like it. And then you can can share it with your friends with this little share button. You can also do this with already made VODs. So for example, if I go to my kick stream, I'll go to my channel and I'll go to my videos and I'll go to my recent broadcast here when we're playing only up. So if you guys want to hang out with us, check us out live on kick, but you can go on any last broadcast that you had in case you missed a clip. So let's go to where I was playing some games. We we're playing the spooky horror game. So maybe I'll just go and grab one here, but you can see that I have the create clip button right on my VOD, my past broadcast. So I'm going to click create clip right at the part that I want to make the clip at. It's going to give it a couple seconds. If the buffering is taking too long, I found that if you literally just click right there, it just like snap loads it. It's kind of weird. I don't know why that happens, but yeah, you can see that it just loaded real fast. You can see we're playing that horror game. So you can just edit your clip like you did before. Let's say this one's good for the time being. I'm going to hit publish. It's going to make our clip. Give it a second. And after you've made the clip, then you can go down into that person's kick channel and go over to their profile. So I got to get out of here. So I'm going to go back to my channel. Then we can go instead of videos, we can go to clips. So now you can see all of the clips that anyone has ever made on my channel and you can filter them through all time and date. So if you don't see a clip that someone made or you made, make sure it says all time. You can sort it by date and that'll show you the most recent ones. And for whatever reason you want to delete a clip, all you have to do is go to your clip section of your channel and then just hover over the clip you want to delete like this testing one. And you can see there's a little X in the top right corner. So we'll just click that X Then we're going to hit the delete button. Give it a second. It says deleted clip has been deleted it's still there obviously so I'm just gonna refresh it with F5 on my keyboard give that a second or two we're gonna go back to clips and you can see the clip is now deleted so good riddance that piece of trash clip but I'm sure they're gonna make plenty of changes since it's still in beta so check the pin comment down below and watch this kick playlist to the side of me it has everything you need to know about kick streaming but my name's Cody and I'll see you in the next one